morning, good morning, good morning. Good morning, good morning, good morning. It is, my forehead is so big. It, it, ew, I look like one of those like trashy people who get like every line as a, um, you know what I'm talking, like highlight, like line. Anyways, good morning, it's Sunday. I'm starting off the vlog. I did not vlog last week because I was feeling like complete and utter. Um, my little, you know, came and I'm just like, why me? Because like when it comes, it's like so bad. And like with me having epilepsy, it makes it kind of worse. Oh, is this the thing? Cut my forehead off because it's humongous. So I'm giving myself a treat. I'm at, you already know where I'm at. Starbies. Shout out to Miss, oops, Miss Bird. That's makeup, y'all. I, I washed it. I don't, whatever. Okay. But I choose two. This is her brand. Go cop a t-shirt. Um, what is her what? I think her website is I choose two. I don't know, but I'll put it in the description box. Oh. So yeah, I'm at Starbucks right now. Can we get into the skin? This just happened. It's like getting darker, but like it's lightening up. That's why I hate being on. Oh. I'm gonna talk to y'all when I hold on. Let me get my drink. Oh, I'm so far. So I got me a oh, I got me a double smoked bacon. I'm trying to stay away from pork. But it's just it's just so good. Look. Okay. You mind your own, you live long. Well, that really used to be stew plantation. That's funny. And this was hometown buffet. That's even funnier. I need to be in that lane. I should go to Costco to get gas, but I don't feel like going over there. Everything is gonna be all right. I'm catching every light. Think I'll make it. Anyhow. Anyways, I'm going to a concert tonight. I'm going to see Maverick City in Kirk Franklin. Do you want a revolution? They're going to play. Ooh. I'm just really excited. Okay, um, I need to contain my composure. I'm a little excited. Um, I need to stop saying um. Okay, yeah, I have nothing to talk about. So, um, I'll see you guys. I said I'm again. I will see you guys when I get to my destination. I kind of want to start a series like car talks, like because I'm like always in the car well i'm not always in the car but i'm in the car a lot and it's like a lot of thoughts that like roam through my head while i'm driving so i'm like oh my gosh i should do like a car talk series let me know this girl that i watch um dang what is her name paris paris danielle y'all should check her channel out um she's she's not like a super big youtuber but she's bigger than me and she has like really good content she's more of the like hair um makeup you know things of that nature i do some stuff like that but i don't really do hair because i truth be told baby i can't do hair i can do my hair but i can't like i can do a braided ponytail and that'd be a little mm. um or i can do my hair So yeah, I will see you guys when I get to my destination because I'm about to go to get some gas. How about just the gas here? I haven't got gas from a place that's not 
Costco in a very long, long time. Good morning, y'all. It is. Oh, excuse me. It's not even morning. It's. Close up. Can this car move? Dang. I hate being blocked in. It's like so annoying. Yeah, stay over there. Let me go on out. Anyway, so I'm leaving Chick fil A. This Chick fil A by my house, bro, is like, it used to be the best Chick fil A, and now it is Bible the worst Chick fil A. It's, they didn't put no bacon on the sandwich. No, they did put bacon on the sandwich, but it was literally like, you know, you like cook a, a, some bacon, right? It was like half of that on the dang sandwich. And it comes with two pieces. You lucky I'm coming here, mother chucka. I do not need no Starbucks. I just really want it. Well, I'm already in line now. Anyway, so yeah, Chick-fil-A. They got me messed up. They want to be rude. And then they going to freaking go check the sandwich. If you check the sandwich, that means you have to touch the sandwich. You have to open it. They going to freaking open it with their freaking hands and be like, "Oh, it has bacon on it." And give and give it to me. What? Anyways, I went to the Maverick City concert last night. Baby. I was blessed. I I was most definitely blessed. The presence of the Lord was there. The presence of the Lord is everywhere. I if you follow me on Instagram, so sorry you had to hear that. I hate when my mom hates when I do that, and I'm starting to hate when I do it too. Where is my chapstick? Bro. This is why I don't like switching purses because when I switch purses, everything don't be everywhere. And it's just not, it's not giving. I'm gonna have to use this little chapstick. This is a chapstick, it's called Lip Naturals Aura Labs. You see it? Yeah. I mean, it's cool. My aunt gave this to me, um, when? Oh, it was for her 50th birthday, we all, y'all know I went to Cabo. Um, yeah. I know I have some more chapstick. Anyways, I'm just about to use this little gloss, because my lips are just now. It's not giving. Anyways, yes, the concert was so lit. I just want to thank, shout out to you, Trinice, for, girl, putting me on to the bath. Because, baby, I was lost in the sauce. I had no idea. I had no idea. Anyways. The concert was amazing even though we had to leave early i'm so mad we left early because i really wanted them to sing um bless me bless me na, 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 na. hey na, 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 na. hey let me let me na, 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 na. we have everything we need something like that but i did get to hear the good songs i wasn't leaving without hearing um kingdom i wasn't leaving without hearing gyra again trying to put me on to gyra that is an amazing song it will bless your spirit and um what is that girl's name she can't sing my god naomi 
Naomi Rain is a beast. Do you hear me? Oh, this dog is so cute. Oh my God, let me show you guys. I don't want to be off in a grill, but look, you can tell doggy. Oh, poochie poochie boo. Yeah. Yeah. So cute. Oh, my God. Oh. It's time for me to order. Hi, good and you? I'm doing well, thank you for asking. Can I get you for today? Um, no food. Okay. Um, can I have a... What do I want? Uh... Oh, can I do a cinnamon dulce iced latte? Yeah, what size? I'll do a grande. You got it. And can I have it with no whip? Can you... But can I do, um... Mmm... Can I do vanilla sweet cream foam with almond milk? Gotcha, so vanilla sweet cream foam and then drink something made out of almond milk, yeah? And that's it. Gotcha, so it looks like it's gonna be 740 at the window. Thank you. Sure. Be nice to your worker, your Starbucks workers, okay? They are so sweet and they're so nice. Well, the, the ones by my house. Don't go to that Chick-fil-A by my house though. If you know where I live, you know what your Chick-fil-A I'm talking about. Don't go there. It is good lady. My lips was chapped, y'all. Uh. Anyways, oh, I've only been drinking alkaline water these days. And I'm loving it. I feel like my skin is skinning. Um, I get this water from Sprouts, but I heard Trader Joe's. Um, well, the Trader Joe's sells alkaline water too, but um, I don't know if they sell it in a pack or if you have to buy it individually. I D K. I was supposed to go to the gym later today with Terrence. We'll see if that Negro gets up and comes with me. I did a photo shoot for my friend's mom. Wow, I haven't said that in a long time. Like, I think we should do a YouTube video. Because that's my girl. Like, I love her. And I missed her the whole time. I was mad as hell because I'm overprotective over my people. And I just don't want to see them hurt. I don't want to see them getting played, getting used. None of that. And I'm also the type of friend that you can't tell me like all the bad things that your, you know, guy, it, your boyfriend is doing to you. Because when I see them, they better keep that same energy. Just because you letting it slide don't mean I am. That ain't my nigga. I don't have to be nice to him. I have to be respectful because I'm going to respect anyone. But then again, if I feel like he disrespecting you, why should I respect him? And I'm gonna be mad at you because you. Yeah. Hi. Okay, I'm gonna do Apple Pay. Yeah. Yeah, if you this is awkward. Um, no, can I have napkins? You guys have forks? Thank you so much. That's not what I was saying. What was I saying? Oh, my friend used to have that car. Oh, so sad. Anyways, um, 
sorry i had to pretend like i wasn't vlogging because it was very much awkward you know everybody's not hip to the whole talking to the camera thing and they'd be like what are you doing i'm like talking to my camera and they're like why i'm like subscribe to my channel <laughs> anyways so yeah i'm not the type of friend that you could just like tell anything like you can tell anything to me like you know talk to me but i need to learn to stop internalizing everything and making everything like such a big deal because look if your friend is letting something ride and she's okay with it he or she's okay with it you have to low-key be okay with it like it sucks but you have to be okay with it because this ended a whole friendship for years like this girl didn't even know one of my friends um significant other passed away like i'm like damn that was like two years three years ago like sheesh i didn't even realize how long it's been but i still keep in contact with her mom because like i said that's my girl like i said before i have told her mom things i ain't even told my mama but we just you know she's just a really and it's not because i don't want to tell my mom it's just certain things you just feel more comfortable talking to other people about and that's okay because my mom and her mom also have that that like relationship where you know if it gets too crazy and i'm talking too you know she's obviously gonna tell my mom and duh but it's not you know if you know you know anyways um yeah it's not your business who it is but if you know you know <laughs> And we just had a really like good conversation. And like we both said, it took some time for us to mature on both sides because we're very, very headstrong and very, very, very hard headed. Like you can't tell us nothing at all. Okay. At all. And it was just like when I, cause I seen her before and i was like super emotional like i didn't show but like i wasn't like crying or nothing but i was like still like super emotional about the situation and i was just like oh my gosh like she's like right here like i i, I had to act as if i didn't know this person which was so weird to me to go from like being best friends to like seeing this person and acting as if you don't even know who they are it's like girl you know everything about me <laughs> what, what, what are we doing and then, like we still have like our little insider so then yesterday when i seen her um at first it was a little awkward you know like Oop, you know hey girl and i'm just like like we can be cordial you know but then it, it, it ended up being more than cordial and it's just a really beautiful thing did i get a fork oh yeah it was just a really beautiful chick-fil-a didn't even give me no fork my adhd y'all know y'all just jumping like Oop. anyways um yeah I really enjoy talking in the car. Come on! Oh, child, the ghetto. I catch y'all when I get back in the house. Two thousand years later. <sighs> What's up, you guys? It is so many days later. <clears throat> It's actually July 28th, Thursday. And I haven't picked up the camera because you guys know, as you guys know, I have epilepsy. And if you're new to this video, I mean, new to this channel, welcome. Don't forget to subscribe. Subscribe. Like, what's wrong with me? Am I dyslexic? I can't talk. I don't know. I haven't been vlogging because I just simply haven't been feeling good. And I just want to come on here and just say to all of my people that have epilepsy and you guys are dealing with it alone i'm not dealing with it alone thank god but if you are dealing with it alone i am definitely keeping you in my prayers there are support groups on facebook um epilep epilepsy awareness you guys should definitely join that and um know that you're not alone i totally understand i feel it i've been feeling like complete this whole week yesterday i had a headache it was so bad like i literally could not even move like it was literally so bad like oh my gosh it was i can't even i i can't i was supposed to vlog yesterday and i couldn't i'm supposed to vlog today really and i just wanted to pick up the camera and just 
say how I'm feeling. I'm just not feeling the best. And epilepsy is so weird. And I really hope that you guys take the time out to like, if you have, um, you know, family members or friends who have epilepsy and, you know, they're dealing with it. I would just try my best to get more information about it. Pray for them and help them in any way possible. There's a lot of um, ways that you can help. So, you know, gain more knowledge and help them. And I know that I always say that I'm trying my best to be um, consistent and to tr and try. I hope you hear my, my air. So sorry, it's hot as heck. So, um, yeah, like I said, I'm, I'm trying to be consistent. I know I say that all the time, but I really am trying. Sometimes I just don't have the energy to get up and do anything. And I really thank God for my parents. I thank God for my boyfriend. I thank God for my family in general. Just even if they're just calling me and FaceTiming me, like Erica and Jasmine, I love you guys. Thank you so much for just calling me and just checking on me. Sometimes Tony, you call me and check on me. All my friends, Trinice, Shira. If I'm missing anybody, um, charge it to my brain, not my heart. But um, I love you guys. And when I feel completely better, I will come back and really vlog, really do some really good videos. But um, for the time being, uh, during this time, don't forget to comment down below some video ideas that you guys want to see. My dog is being weird. Um, she look at her i don't know anyway so um even stuff like this like i'm gonna read you guys this post really quick it really epilepsy messes with the brain it help makes you forget things spaced out look at this oh it's not focusing it says epilepsy awareness recovery from a seizure is not just a case of seizure over get up and go after a seizure many people feel confused sleepy and spaced out i'm always spaced out <clears throat> which can last for a few hours or even a couple days everybody is different don't assume make it your business to find out and when i seen that i was just like yes yeah. so i had to post that um but yeah you're doing too much so i'll be back when i feel better